I still feel as if a cannonball was fired, shooting through the back of my heart. Through tears and a soul's cry for justice, Laura Jordan and Michael Middleton read victim impact statements during the sentencing of Adrian Gonzalez. I don't have a solution to this situation, nor do I know what justice looks like in this scenario. I just know this cannot be allowed to happen again. Whatever it takes. Tuesday, while onlookers gathered outside, inside Santa Cruz Superior Court, Judge John Salazar handed down the maximum sentence. Adrian Gonzalez will spend another four years in juvenile detention following a guilty plea for the murder of Madison Middleton. This is a crime that absolutely rocked our community. Gonzalez admitted to the 2015 abduction, torture, rape and murder of eight-year-old Maddie. But the recently passed Senate Bill 1391, which is now law, mandates 14 and 15 year old juveniles cannot have their cases moved to adult criminal court. When children 14 and 15 year old are housed with adults, they're more likely to engage in more violent behavior in the future. Opponents of the law and of Gonzalez remaining in the juvenile court system say the safety of the community is at stake. Nothing short of a life sentence for aging, for what he did, and to keep society safe, to keep our kids safe. We do not need another child going through the horrendous torture. Gonzalez addressed the court saying his goal is to overcome his issues. I hope that one day I may earn forgiveness. Thank you. Loved ones say the wound he inflicted will never heal. After 30 minutes, years of legal proceedings ended but not the pain for the family and friends of Madison Middleton.